Thanks to the lecturer responsible for this uh, lab evaluation. In this video presentation, we from group 9 will explain briefly on the lab experiment conducted throughout this lab. Without further ado, I will begin the presentation on uh, on part 1, which is common emitter BJT amplifier. Uh, the transistor of model BC182BP is chosen for this investiga investigation. From the data sheet we obtain online, we can uh, obtain the beta value, IC and VCE. And specifically, we choose BC182 with the beta value of 80, IC of 100 milliampere, and VCE of 5 volt. And from there, we also assume that VCC is equal to 10 volt. Next, we have to find all the data required uh, for this configuration. First, since IE is approximately equal to IC, then we can assume that IC is equal to IE. Then by using the formula RE is equal to 26 milli over IE, we get uh, the value of RE equal to 260 milli ohm. Then uh, given that AV, given that AV is, we know the voltage gain is equal to negative 90, by using this formula, we are able to uh, find the value of RC and RL. However, RC and RL, which means we got two unknown. So by in this case, we assume RC is equal to 30 ohm. And by that, we have a, a value of RL of 106.36 ohm. Next is the value of RE. By using this particular formula, we have a value of 20 ohm. Then next is the value of VB, R1 and R2. By using this formula, we get a value of VB equal to 2.7 ohm. Then in this assumption, uh, B beta RE is larger and equal to 10 R2. And R2 is larger or equal to 160. Therefore, we can assume R2 is 160 ohm. And by using this formula, we can find the value of R1 and R1 is 572.59 ohm. And this is the multi-scene design of the amplifier and the octage voltage waveform uh, that we obtain from the multi-scene design. Then from the waveform from multi sim we can determine the value output voltage and input voltage. From this, we can obtain the voltage gain, which is AV, by using this formula. And, and we obtain a value, AV uh, value of negative 86.96, or negative 91.49 and the voltage can by bypass configuration by using this formula and we have a voltage scan of negative 1.5 and but finally we calculate the percentage error which is approximately 3.38 percent and 1.16 percent net is part 2 common source dft amplifier uh, the objective is to study the characteristic of common source dft amplifier the transistor we use is 2N5196 and then for the data sheet, we uh, get the VGS, VGS cutoff, IDDS, VDS and ID and then we did the calculation, uh, we find the GM and then uh, we find the RD from the formula AV equal to V out over V in and then we get the RS and then we assume the RG is equal to 10 mega ohm and then we get the VRD equal to uh, VRD uh, using the formula ohm the uh, the formula VRD equal to IDRD uh, and then uh, we uh, find the VDD uh, by using the formula VDD equal to VDS plus VRD and then this is the matrix that we, uh, we get from the multi um, V output is from the B channel, uh, which is the value is negative one three five point one seven nine milli, and then the voltage input is from the channel A, uh, is thirty seven point one one milli, and then from this value we put on the formula A V equal to V out over V in, then we get the voltage gain is negative three point six volt.